Barrio's backyard. Barrio's, oh my God. Did you see it? Yeah. Is so much crazy? for the. Did you ever? Well, you. No, I know he's a big bocce. Ball I know. I was gonna say he doesn't. He doesn't shut up about it. But in fairness, like that's awful. That's half his house. Well, I would be worried that the house is gonna go next. Like what? Isn't yeah. did, did it drop into the street? Yeah, it all. Oh my in God. In fact, the street was blocked off all night. Wow. There was another one of those. Uh, hasn't Laurel Canyon or yeah. been shut off from that balcony that came yeah. down the side of the hill? Yeah. Yeah. How are you? On another note, I have a TV show. <laughs> <laughs> and, and it's very funny. Like priorities. Yeah, exactly. People's houses are falling into the sea. So well, then they need you to make them laugh. Applause. That's why. See, it all works out, Howie. It does. Reg, okay, ready when you I'm are, ready. love. I'm ready. Here we go. When is this air? Tonight. Monday, oh, Monday. 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 This is going to air Monday. So I'll say tonight. Right. Professional. Oh, is that your first rodeo? <laughs> Here we go. I used to host a rodeo show. Did that you really? Thing. Oh, yeah. For Fox, bareback saddle bronc and bull riding. Oh, yeah. I loved it. You I were the host? It. Oh, yeah. I was the host. Wow. And I was towering over the, the cowboys because they're all like that big. They are? Yeah. They're cowboys like are little. Yeah, they're like jockeys. Bull riders? Bull riders. Yeah, like. Ty uh, but how do you commentate a seven second sport? Isn't Very quickly. It, isn't it seven or eight <laughs> seconds? What is the. Yeah, eight seconds eight is seconds, actually yes. a, a good ride. Right. 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 A lot, it was a lot of the precursory interviews and post, post interviews. Which is all it. And then seven seconds. And seven in seconds, yeah. Of heaven. Seven seconds of heaven. That was a fun game you played in junior that's high. A, that's a college date. <laughs> oh, you went to college. I was junior high. I didn't go to college. I oh, just assumed I... that that's what dating in college was like. That's dating for me now. Dating in college was <laughs> my left hand. <laughs> Here you go. Live on Facebook. Here we go. Why I gotta be live? <laughs> Why is it gotta be left? Oh, it's the greatest story when my mic's not up to tell you about. My left hand reminded yes, you of? Yeah, yeah. Oh my God. No, it's actually amazing. Somebody I worked with said, what's the other hand for when somebody else did it? <laughs> I'll tell you when my mic's not on. Okay, here we go. Okay, Kat. What? You can't just. I know, but okay. yeah, I'm sure the children in the audience don't want to hear that. Yeah, coming up after the break. <laughs> Three. You're just pulling my... <laughs> Is muscle. that your leg? <laughs> <laughs> We're having fun, and we haven't done anything. <laughs> okay, here I we go. I partnered up. Three. I'm going to count me in. Okay, ready? <laughs> Three. I'm, I'm ready. just saying that to Reggie. Oh. oh right. okay, you yeah, I'm ready, babe. I thought you were going to count yourself in. <laughs> oh, my God, this is hard. Three, two... He has partnered up with Just for Laughs for the second Howie Mandel All-Star Comedy Gala. Here he is, Howie Mandel. To tell you more about it. Thank you. Thank you. It would be very awkward Thank you. if I said the Howie Mandel Gala and then it wasn't you. But yeah, it, I don't know how awkward that would be. The fact, it's awkward for me to be at a gala or a gala. <laughs> is it what gala say, or gala? I, I don't gala. know. I don't know. I had tomatoes there. Did you? Um, yes. I had a potato, so it all See, worked out I for have us. No, let's call the whole thing off. <laughs> Okay, but the thing is... I just set you right up for that one. Okay. It wasn't a great one. No, it wasn't a great one, but no, we're but just getting warmed up. We are. Yeah. We are, and that's because you have a heater. You have a space... People don't know that there's a space heater. Uh, you know it's what? Actually it's cold. actually a tanning bed. Um, I get a, a little LeBron's while I sit here. You know? I think you're done on this side. <laughs> Should I rotate? Should Kenny I Rogers? rotate? Kenny Rogers again, Rogers it's like dating again. <laughs> anyway, the okay. thing is, it, Just for Laughs is the Mecca Festival in Montreal, held every year mm -hmm. annually. For anybody who is anybody in comedy, that's where they're found, that's where they go to, and all the biggest names of comedy have been going there for 34 years, mm -hmm. and the lovely people at the CW have uh, chosen me to host a gala or a gala, and it's a two-hour special tonight mm -hmm. on the CW at 8 o'clock Eastern, and what you should do is watch it. There's Jay Farrow, there's Tom Papa, there's Eliza Schlesinger, there's uh, Russell Peters, there's a whole uh, 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 plethora of plethora. comedians. I always love the word plethora. The I knew you did. That's why off. I did it for you. <laughs> okay, so how blue is this going to get? Blue means raunchy. Well, you don't think they understand I your... Don't know. I don't know. How... I don't, I don't want to overestimate the intelligence of the audience. You know what I no, mean? No, you weren't overestimating. <laughs> you were underestimating. How blue does it get? How blue does it get? Oh, you meant you, uh, as opposed to them thinking it was a very, like, a democratic kind of... Uh... No, I, no, well, given the political state we've been in, it yes. probably did assume um, that. Well, it is television. It is the CW. I think uh, we don't... 
I think the kids could gather around, but you might have to explain some things to the kids. <laughs> okay. I don't know that there's anything really blue. It is, you know, standard television and not cable. But uh, it is a good question. I don't even think it was a really good question. I did. I just but I, but, uh, but my to answer is fantastic. <laughs> How blue does it get? It's not like I'm cable. I'm just reading the prompter. Okay, it's right over here. Here's all your questions. Do you want to go through was them? Was that a question? Is there any ones you don't want to answer at this point? Look no. At, I'm in charge here. I love it. So, give me that. Give me that. Give me that. Give me that. It's the reason she explained to you. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Here it is. Here it is. How blue, I don't know if they can, can you see that on this camera? Or is it that, a, how blue does it get? And then they put raunchy in brackets because she didn't know what she meant That's by how true. blue. That's not true. Why? What, what, why I do they, exactly, why do I they explain to you what Mario the question means? Because Mario was originally supposed to do this interview and he doesn't know what it means. <laughs> Oh. So anyway, you are so. Will you quick. be just hosting, or will you be doing a set? You're so much more beautiful than Mario. <laughs> oh well, I don't know about that. I think he wears more makeup than I do because That's, you are really oh, throwing him oh, under a bus. That's not true. That's not true at all. Okay. Mario looks amazing. He doesn't age. I need a lot of makeup. Really? Yeah. You're, you when you wash this off? It's a whole different person. I use the is. men's restroom when I wash this off. Oh wow. Yeah. And, and what do you use the other hand for? <laughs> That's what she said. Now, back to you. Are you going to be doing just a set or are you hosting? Are you hosting just I'm gonna, a set? I'm going to do a set. I'm going to do I, I'm going to do a show my wares a little bit and then bring on other stars. Okay. Yes. Uh, other stars which you've listed. Are there any special surprises that we should list? Yes. There is very there's a lot of special surprises. <laughs> Is there another question? Nope, that was it. The interview's okay. over. Is it really? <laughs> so tonight on the CW, it's a two-hour special okay, Howie listen. Mandel's Superstar <laughs> Comedy Gala. Okay. Now, I, I, I'm so, um, you know what I'm most excited about? I've never been invited to a gala. It's a what gala. What are you going to wear to the gala? What do you wear to a gala? Have you, have you been to, to galas? Yeah, you have to wear, it's black tie. I didn't, then I dress. Watch me dress in properly for my gala tonight <laughs> on, the CW on the CW. Is it, because I should have known. I knew I was hired to do a gala. I didn't know that that's the proper attire. Let me ask you a question, completely independent of this. Um, how did you get started in stand-up, just out of curiosity? Because I'm thinking about getting into How did business. I get started? Yeah. I usually start by saying, how is everybody tonight? And then I move on to the act. Oh. Look at that. Time's up. Got to go. Um, how did well, you get into stand-up comedy? Set, is your uh, wrist, you're able to, is that, do you have a tattoo? White tattoos, yeah. You have a white tattoo? Yeah. I've never seen that. She has a white tattoo. That's kind of redundant, <laughs> isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Is this your actual face, or is it a white I already, tattoo? I already told you, it's a mask, it's removed, and I yeah. set it on the table. I've never heard of that. That's great. Wait, will you answer I my question? Yes, I will. How I, did you get on started? a dare. How did you get started? On a dare. Okay, truth on or a, dare? No, it was a dare. That's I was at a comedy club in the 70s, and my friends dared me to get up. They said, after the show, we're going to let amateurs come up, and they dared me to get up. One thing leads to another. And I'm sitting and talking to a lady, a white lady with white tattoos. Kellen, do you want to come on up, up here? I think he's referring to you. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? What are I you doing? I just looked for the, the closest white blonde girl. It was Kellen. Kellen does all of our social media. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so you stand up comedy. You it happened on a are dare. We? Follow along here. We're almost uh, done. Yeah, um, a hostess with ADHD. <laughs> it's wonderful. Yeah. Something shiny off to the side. Yeah, and we're why, off. That's why I'm shocked that this interview actually comes to fruition. Because Plus, with both of us together, it's a hard interview. It is. It's like we're playing oh, tennis. Oh, look. I'm looking for another blonde woman. Let me try to find another bald listen, Jewish guy. Listen, given... Well, that won't be hard in L.A. <laughs> we're all over the place. We'll find it here. Yes. <laughs> oh, you won't find a, a bald Jewish guy in L.A.? Yeah, you will. <laughs> I don't know what that means, but apparently it yeah. means something to you. It means a lot to me. Yeah, do you yeah, like Dave, bald like, Jewish men? Yeah, I love them. You That's do? my type. It is? Yeah. I'm your type? You're my type. Are you flirting? <laughs> kind of. Wow. <laughs> and now it's getting excited. <laughs> okay. There's given... I, the if had I known you were flirting, I would have invited you to my gala. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's actually on Monday, so you have time. Um, tonight. Okay. Tonight. Right. tonight. Tonight. It's tonight. Okay. In stand-up comedy. This is Monday. You, at this point, given the whole political climate that we're in with the president-elect just a couple weeks away from taking office, yeah. how much fun do you have with that? How much material does somebody like Donald you know, Trump I don't do? You know, I don't do a lot of material about no. politics. I like the idea 
that when people come see me or they come see wherever I am, that they can kind of, because uh, uh, as much as a lot of people are laughing and having a good time, there seems to be a lot of angst in America yeah. right now. And I look at a, a moment with myself as just a, an escape. Yeah. So even if when you're making fun, I think it reminds people that maybe we're not in a place. So when you see his press conference, you don't take anything away from or What did you I think did. when he, you saw he, that? I did. He bandied about the fact that he's a germaphobe. So I felt a kid. There you go. Yeah. But I kind of, I didn't think that was a great excuse. I talked about that. You know, I didn't think that was a great excuse for his uh, not being involved in what he said he was involved in. Okay. Because... Urine is a known sterile, sterile fluid that yes. you're supposed to put on snake bites right. and other things. And showers are always good. Not golden, but it's not the golden rule. But it's, you're either uh, in or you're out. You know what I mean? And sometimes you're, in you're in and out and in and out. In what? Sometimes you're in Russia, in and out. I don't get it, but I'm going to be a good guest and laugh at it. No, it's not funny. It isn't? No, I was saying oh, you're in. Oh, it was a drama. You're in. Like, you're in, but you're either oh, in you're, or you're, you're in. Oh, you're in. I can't. I I mean, no, I, I love it. I got to work with the I love it. You know what? You should do stand-up. up here? Well, I, I think, do it sitting down. That's I think you, well, you should be a sit-down stand-up who explains <laughs> her humor. Just like in brackets, raunchy. <laughs> like, they explain the questions. Well, my name's Carissa. Remember that show, Clarissa Explains It All? Maybe we could do a revision of that. Do I look like a little girl who watches Nickelodeon? Well, you look like a man. <laughs> who knows a lot about everything. I do so I know. I do know that show. Melissa well, Joan Hart. I know. I know. You oh, love you, her. I, do, I love her. Well, I mean, she's great, right? She is great. And that's why we're here today. Okay. How great is Melissa Joan Hart? <laughs> okay. How great is this interview? <laughs> now, one last, thi one last thing. One last thing that we need out of this? To, yeah, we're getting a lot out of it. One last thing that we need to know about the show on Monday or tonight. Okay. Is that the question? Yeah. And I have and to come up with one last yeah, thing? Yeah. Well, I, I just want, what do you want viewers to take away other than having a good time? Why is this something you want to be involved in? Why is it something I want to be involved? Yeah. How do you know I want to be involved? Maybe I just was involved, and now it's airing, and I'm telling people to watch it. Maybe I didn't want to be there. <laughs> Maybe I didn't enjoy myself. That's not true. I had a great time. You'll have a great time. Watch it. 8 o'clock, The CW, tonight. It'll be funnier and better than this interview. Okay, you know what You know what? And will be funnier? And we didn't set the bar. We didn't set the bar that high here. No, so, but what I'm really looking forward to is Karaoke Showdown. That's already on. You know that. No. It aired last Thursday, and it's airing Wait, every Thursday night. Do you think I follow night. your every move? And, like, I'm supposed no, to no, know no, everything? No, 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 it's okay. With your karaoke showdown, yeah. you're looking forward to seeing episode two, yeah. which airs Thursdays on Spike, and it's hosted by the lovely Craig Robinson. So it's like a, uh, you know, a, a cash cab meets uh, Don't Forget the Lyrics. People jump into the car, and they got to sing songs for big cash and prizes. He's the host. I'm the executive producer, and uh, I'm a. Uh, phen you can't tell by watching the show because it's a great show. But I'm an amazing executive producer. Are you? Oh. What makes you such an amazing executive producer? It's uh, it's a scent. Yeah. I have. I smell. I'm the best smelling executive producer <laughs> in television. I've been told. And best. You dress. can't tell you me here, style. but what? You have good style. I like your style. Do you want to read this since I haven't been able to do anything right in this interview? It says, it's in brackets, goodbye. <laughs> but it says, be sure to check out the Howie Mandel All-Star Comedy Gala tonight on the CW. Yeah. There you go. Goodbye. <laughs> You're amazing. You're the best. Always an adventure, Howie. You're oh, amazing. So tell Howie. me the story about the other.